Hello everyone, welcome back. Um, my name's Nicky Hawkins, West Ham fan TV, and to be honest, our greatest fears have been realised this morning. Um, a press conference just now with Slaven Bilic has confirmed what uh, I think we've all known all along that Dimitri Payet does not want to play for West Ham United anymore. Um, I'm not shocked, that's not the word. I'm disappointed. Um, because you know he, he had such a great season last year. He's still, I, I, I'm going to say this, even to to this moment, he's still the greatest player I've ever seen to play for West Ham. Um, he did it for one season. He's been good in patches this season, not as not as great, but I honestly believe he's had his head turned um, by the big clubs in the summer. Um, he's 29, coming up 30, so it's probably his last chance for a big move. I don't know where he's going. Um, he'll probably end up back at Marseille, which is uh, which is disappointing. Um, but basically, um, the way I read this is, um, Billy just said we're not going to sell. We're not in the in the um, in the position to sell our best players. But to me, this cries out as a you know, come get him, he's for sale, he don't want to be here anymore, uh, plea. So I do expect him to leave this transfer window. Um, as I said, I'm disappointed. Um, he's got a history of doing this, to be quite honest with you. Um, it just goes to prove that everything he said before um, was a little bit of lip service. I do believe he, he, he does love the club, or did love the club. Um, but once again, I, I, I'm going to reiterate this, I don't think the club have matched his ambitions. But that makes no excuse for a player to turn around and say, you know, he, he was all well and good taking a pay rise last year and, you know, signing a five-year contract. Why so I have to sign a five-year contract? It's got to be to do with the ambition of the club. Now, that makes no excuses for him, though, because to do that to a team and teammates that um, you enjoyed relative success with last year, um, and then just to come out in January and, 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 and drop this bombshell um, it's not it's not what you do <laughs> at a workplace you know they're you know they're still scrapping for their lives you know the, the least he could have done is to kept his mouth shut waited till the summer then done something then made sure we're out of trouble but he didn't he's come out and said it now now what does this leave West Ham now I always I'm going to reiterate this. No player is bigger than the club, whether it be Dimitri Payet, Carlos Tevez, Paolo Di Canio, even down to Billy Bonds uh, and, and and Bobby Moore, you know, probably make some exceptions for them too. But no player is bigger than the club. If you don't want to be here, just sh shot, you know, shot him on. But the thing with West Ham, we've got to make sure they do. There's no replacing Dimitri Payet. There's no replacing him with... Um, you know, in, in the current transfer window. There's no replacing the, the talent he's got with the money that we'll get for him. Um, but what we can do, um, cash in now, I, I'd say that. I, I don't want a player around like that. And I, I don't think Billich is one to uh, take falls lightly as well. You know, we've seen departures in the past. Mauro Zorati, Amal Fatano, they're not Dimitri Payet, but they cross the boss. But what we can do is we can get the money and make sure we get the goal scorer we need. We've got enough um, talent in the team with Lanzini, uh, Fernandez to create goals. Make sure we use the money wisely. You know, you're going to get 30 plus million for him and make sure you get that. Otherwise, it's not worth letting him go. But use the money wisely. You know, spend big. You need to spend big now because, you know, this is the reason these players want to leave. It's not a shock to me that these players want to leave but you know spend big let them go spend big and match our ambitions at least and you know do something to soften the blow for the West Ham fans um, but let him go if you don't want to be here let him go you can't you, you can't afford to carry passengers and you know at the moment if he doesn't want to play he's not putting in the effort we can all see that in certain games you know let him leave let him leave and and you know we can build from there there's no there's no need to hold on to players like that because 
although he's got a five-year contract, all that does in retrospect is, is you know, guarantee us a bigger fee. So let him go, move on. There was a West Ham before Payet, there will be a West Ham after Payet, but make sure we use the money wisely and start to bring some players in that do want to play for the football club and uh, do want to play for the fans. Anyway, thanks very much. Um, sorry to bring in this sad news, to be honest, but um, don't forget to check out the rest of our content. This is just a quick video, just to let everyone know that you know our worst feels have been confirmed. So thanks very much, but upwards and onwards. Come on, you irons.